Have you ever wanted to see what you'd look like as a 3D model? Well, the structure sensor might help you out. My name is Lexi Savides from CNET here at CES 2015, looking at the structure sensor. Now this is a depth sensing camera and it connects to an iPad for the best experience. However, it also works on Android, Windows, Linux, and another number of other operating systems, but iOS will give the best experience with the number of apps that are available. So, it's got a built-in battery, so it doesn't eat any of the juice from your iPad. Let's take a look at how it works. So, we'll launch the Scanner app. This is a part of the ecosystem of the Structure Scanner. Find your subject, position them in the frame, then all you need to do is hit the button and start moving around your subject. This will create a 3D model. Once you're finished, you get to do a whole bunch of different options. You can see the X-ray sort of skeleton kind of view. You can see the plain old 3D view. Or even more interestingly, you can use the color mode. You can add color to the face so it looks pretty photorealistic. Now it's actually using the iPad camera to, to obtain that color information rather than the depth sensing camera in the structure sensor. Now what you can do with this is a whole bunch of different things. You can either export it to 3D programs or you can create your own 3D mini-me on a 3D printer. Kind of cool, huh? You can also create depth maps of rooms so you can actually immediately see dimensions of rooms and how they look on a floor plan layout. The structure sensor will cost 379 US dollars. It's available now on structure.io. My name is Lexi Savides from CES 2015. Check out all the coverage over at cnet.com.